Sometimes your teachers may be using a lockdown browser with your quizzes in Schoology. How would you know? So if you clicked on a quiz in Schoology, you might see this type of message, or if you try to start the quiz, or you maybe resume a quiz, you'll see this box. It can't open the page of the Schoology quiz. So just close out of that. Kind of pay attention if you see the words lockdown browser, and if you see that, you're going to have to do these steps. So you just have to click the sign out button in the bottom right hand corner. So go ahead and click sign out and then click sign out the blue button and it will sign you out of the device. And you're not going to sign in to the Chromebook. Instead, you're going to use what's called the lockdown browser kiosk. And it's actually in the bottom left corner of the screen. It's called apps. So you're going to tap on apps and you're going to click on Lockdown Browser right here. It's going to load up this special Lockdown Browser screen. The first time that it loads up, it might show where you get to pick a school site uh, such as this, or it might flip you into the MCS App Portal. If it does come here, click the gear at the very top because we need to go back to the one screen. So on this screen, there's two different drop-down boxes. The first box, you want to make sure you select Modesto City Schools. The second box, you're going to select MCS Schoology. So you only have to do this the first time. This lockdown browser will remember uh, what you selected, Modesto City Schools, and make sure you have MCS Schoology as a second box. Once you do, click Select, and it will remember these settings for next time. Then just go ahead and sign into Schoology as normal, your student ID and password, and you're going to be heading to your course in Schoology that you have that quiz that the teacher set the lockdown browser on. So go ahead and choose the course that the quiz is in, and once you're there, we'll go back to the material in the course, and we'll click on the quiz that's waiting for you. So once you do that, and it will start the lockdown browser process. So lockdown browser means you're in this quiz, in this browser taking the quiz. Just click start an attempt and it's going to load your exam. So lockdown browser doesn't let you get to any other websites at this time. Complete the different questions uh, that you're being asked and click submit. And when you're all done, say yes. This will automatically know that you finished. So then all you do is click Exit Schoology at the end of the quiz, and it will say, hey, you're done. Exit the lockdown browser. Click on that blue button, and it brings you back to your sign-in screen where you can just sign in normally to your device. So let me show you one more time. Uh, if you're getting to a test or quiz, just apps in the bottom left if the teacher using lockdown browser. Then you click lockdown browser, and then that's going to load up. You remember, it saved your settings. And so it won't need you to ask you for your MCS uh, Schoology or Modesto City Schools in that first screen. Again, just sign in to Schoology as you normally would. Lockdown browser is only for tests or quizzes that a teacher has set the lockdown browser for. So not every test or quiz in Schoology will need this. Uh, just if you get those errors like we saw at the beginning of the video, you'll need to uh, turn on this kiosk mode. So here we go, going to another test that the teacher set the lockdown browser to. Again, you'll see the start new attempt. That's where you'll see, and you'll be able to load the exam in the lockdown browser on the Chromebook. So again, this is just for Chromebooks. Uh, and then here, completing the quiz as normal. And then when you're all done completing the quiz, the end of the quiz will actually say, hey, you finished we're going to exit back to your login screen. So when you're all done, finish, say yes, you've completed, and then you'll have that button to exit out of the lockdown browser and continue to log into your device as normal uh, to continue using your student device. Thank you.